Hello all you awesome people out there, my name is Akira and welcome back to this let's play of Emily is Away 2 And this will uh, be the last episode because chapter 5 is the last one So what we have, Punk Forever It's just so nice knowing you're real And Punk Forever again I, did, I think I said Pumpkin Actually I think that will be her nickname if I should have to give her one Pumpkin uh, and what you still, and that you're still around, even though you know the real me. That's what she said to my last episode. To me. Yeah. So, but uh, we will jump in into summer 2007 because now we have our girlfriend here and Em is talking to us again. Or oh, Emily. She asked us not to call her Em anymore because that would be awkward now that I have a girlfriend, I think. That I give her a nickname. So, Monday, June 25th, after senior year. So let's see. What do we have? We have. I have no clue what this is. This one doesn't see. The ring a bell either. What the fuck was that? I think it was something outside. It sounded like. I don't know. Um, Mir, isn't that the song from. Um, uh, Or I might think of Mika. I have no clue. Anyways, office, Grace. That picture for some reason looks like Markiplier. <laughs> uh, oh, was that the year Transformers came out? Very sure. I know what this is. This seems. I. I maybe it seems um, familiar because it looks like um, the Morph Ball in Samus, uh, or in the Metroid games. Uh, this is Portal. I know that. Uh, and I don't know that, but I actually like the Transformers movies, so I would go for that. So we have Foo Fighters, Kanye West, uh, Kanye West, and Modest Moves. I actually like Foo Fighters most uh, of these. Um, I'm not listening to much of the music though, uh, any of them. And Emily is talking to me, so I will just see what she's saying in a moment. I'll just read this one out. I'm not like the others. You're the pretender. What if I say I will never surrender? Same old story, and oh, we have Ratatouille, we have Harry Potter, super bad. I actually like the Ratatouille movie. Not everyone can become a great artist, but a great artist can come from anywhere. And that quote is so true. I actually like that quote. Maybe I should um, put it somewhere, maybe in my Twitter. Maybe I will put it in my Twitter or something. But yeah, that is so true because. Uh, not everyone can become it. Um, I know that for a fact, because, but, people has skills in many things, but people can come from everywhere and become great if they just try. Uh, not everyone will succeed in it. I know that for a fact. Um, I really hope every, I really hope that everyone can succeed in what they're doing, um, but. If you think about it, some people come from different way of lives and different places. And sometimes just one person that you never expected will become great in something. And that's it's why I like this quote, because not everyone can achieve greatness, but greatness can come from anywhere. So, oh, in this case, an artist can come from anywhere in life. So. Just because, but also, I'm rambling about this corona. Uh, but also because many people I've seen uh, who had famous parents, for example, that made great things, and then the kids try to go in their footsteps and they don't succeed, maybe. Uh, and that's also how I interpret the first line not everyone can become a great artist because sometimes they just try something and then fall fat because they cannot live up to their parents at all because they're trying to but they, they're not built for that thing so that's how I observed it the first thing but the last but a great artist can come from everywhere it's just as I said before every point in life you can rise to greatness if you just try but don't try to do what your parents did to become famous do what you want to do so and that's why I'm doing YouTube videos apparently <laughs> <laughs> because that's the only talent I have, which is maybe 
that true, but anyways, anyways, onwards. Uh, no expectations, no disappointments. Uh, mistakes aren't always regrets. Mm. Yeah, mistakes is not always regrets. That sounds pretty true. Hey, Takeru. Yo! Emily? What are you up to? Mm. New music. Uh, just downloading new music. How about. Are you downloading? It's 2007, so. Was downloading a really a thing here? And I don't think there was that many sites on the internet where you can download music uh, legally. I'm not sure. It's just been so many years. It's 10 years ago. I'm old now. How about you? Let's see. I'm getting some stuff ready for college, actually. Someone's flying by. <laughs> Have you started getting ready yet? Yeah, some stuff, but not a lot really. Oh, Kings of Leon. I think actually they have made some good music too. Actually, fun that she's uh, listening to them. So, because when I think about what kind of music she likes, then I, I wouldn't expect them, but oh well. <laughs> no worries. You have time. I'm getting really excited for it. Uh, because you're moving out, leaning. Uh, excited because of the new people? Yeah, that's definitely part of it. Mostly I think I'm excited for a fresh start, you know. I can't wait to leave high school behind. Well, keep in touch uh, though, right? We'll keep in touch though, right? Oh, I can't read. Oh yeah, I think so. Are you excited for college? Yeah, I am. It should be fun to do something new. Right, and I'm sure a, a good couple like you and Evelyn can get through it. Who said Evelyn? Uh, I know we can. Uh, who's, I know we can. Yeah, I know we can. How are you two doing, by the way? We're good. Both happily happy it's finally summer. And she's online. Can I talk to her? Not yet. Oh, and here she is. <laughs> oh, and here. She is now. I'll let you go. I'll let you go so you can talk to her. You don't have to. Let's see. Yo, I was telling you were online. Okay, she's on the offline. Yo, where's Grandit? <laughs> no worries, I got her one anyway. Goodbye. Oh, I didn't say goodbye to her. <laughs> How are you? I'm alright. How are you? I'm missing you, so that's why. If you're not here, I'm alright. I'm pretty alright too. Just chilling. What are you up to? Mm. <laughs> Thinking about you, up, uh, about to put on some music. <laughs> oh, what kind of music? Punk rock, obviously. Your fave. Send me a link so I can listen to. Uh, actually, I will take a link part because I don't know. YouTube.com. <laughs> no, no. YouTube. <laughs> dot com slash what's question mark v uh, equals eight s g y c u k a f q q 
New Linkin Park? I haven't heard this yet. Oh man, I really like this song. Listen to it with me. That was my plan. I actually think that one thing that's funny, um, I noticed it just now actually. Um, in the last game, when you get to this last um, chapter, uh, many of the things you're typing in is actually you sending things to them and they respond instead of they asking you things and you respond. Uh, like here, when you actually send a link instead of they always sending you me links. So maybe that run the same there, but I really hope that she doesn't break up with me until the end because that would be heartbreaking in more than one way because I really want, because the, the first one uh, hadn't, it did not have a happy ending. It was just like how when I tried to tell her my feelings, it was just like goodbye and how school, how's the weather, stuff like that, small talks, things. So I really hope that this doesn't end out like this at all. But um, let's see. Uh, listen to me. That was my plan. Oh man, I can't wait to hang out tomorrow. Uh, <laughs> oh, I forgot. I'm not today. I'm excited for our date tomorrow too. Okay, I don't think it will be bad. By that. Thank you, it's fine summer. Fuck high school! <laughs> so, her school's out. <laughs> right, fuck high school. <laughs> I take that. That reminds me, you never guessed who I talked to earlier today. Hmm. The Pope? <laughs> well, given enough tries, I probably could. <laughs> okay, sure, you could. But really, I talked to Emily from our running class last semester. Uh, what did you two talk about? Well, apparently you two used to be really close. Ugh. Um, a long time ago seems like a dick move to Emily because I still talk to her. Uh, still, uh, I don't know if she will get mad at me. I'm sorry that will be because I didn't tell her. Uh, this one is actually a hot choice. I take we still kind of. Yeah, we, we were. We still are kind of. Oh good, it sounded like you were really good friends. She had a lot of really nice things to say about you. <laughs> You're not mad or anything like that? <laughs> I'll just make sure. <laughs> uh, of course not, why would I be? Phew. I will admit, at first I was kind of worried. Well, you didn't have to be. I know, I guess I'm just used to people trying to manipulate me. Like how Steve used to be with me. I promise I'm not like that. I know, it's just nice to know you're real. You didn't fabricate a persona just to get close to me or something. Of course not, that would be stupid. I know, I think sometimes people obsess over details like that. As if a good couple needs to have the same uh, opinion about everything. But honestly, it's the most important thing, I think. Um, yeah, I agree. I don't want a relationship uh, built on lies. Yeah, exactly. Sorry, I didn't mean to <laughs> derail the conversation, lol. <laughs> no worries. 
Did we really say we vowed that much when we were younger? Oh god. I'm just really lucky to be with you. <laughs> oh, shut up. Well, you're too nice. You know what? I was thinking about earlier today. Our problem uh, shenanigans. That was really so fun. I don't know what we did. That's not a good thing. It was going to prom was swell. And then just hanging out after was awesome source. Mm. The awesome of source. God, that actually cringeworthy. There's things they're saying because that slang we used for ten ten years ago, or actually, I actually didn't use it because, uh, as some of you may know, I'm actually Danish and I was typing a lot of. I I didn't speak that much in English when I was typing when I was um, younger, uh, mostly because I um I actually don't know what it's called, but I'm really bad at spelling and reading and stuff like that. I have gotten better at reading. I have noticed. Um, over the uh, last couple of years, actually the last two years when I've been playing, uh, play, uh, making, well, but I can't speak for some reason, but I've been better at uh, reading since I started doing YouTube and lift playing, because I have to read out loud instead of in myself, because when I read in myself, I can read, and I get the words when I'm reading them, even though I say, uh, pronouncing them wrong, but here when I read, I have to do it fast and clearly, so you all understand what I'm saying, and also, I have to do it properly, and sometimes I know I mess up sometimes, but I think I'm getting better at reading and not making a lot of mistakes. So I have to start all around what I'm trying to read. Um, and this series here is going pretty pretty well, I think. Uh, but um, I just had to the awesome source, yeah. Um, so, but yeah, it, it it hasn't been improved. But yeah, as I said, what was it? Oh, right, I was talking about the, the slang languages. Uh, I was typing a lot in Danish, and then I, the only slang I really used was things like um, short of sentences like lol and see ya and all those kind of things. Um, and not that major in English. It's actually first after I started doing YouTube that I actually have gotten a friend that is either speaking English or it's the only way that I can communicate with them because they have a foreign language that is not English. And German, for that matter, I can't actually, I can understand German and speak German and stuff like that. So, uh, but then I had to type in English and I've gotten a lot better to it since then also. So I'm using a more of the slang, but I've never used the slang that you're using here because <laughs> that's slang for 10 years ago. And slang 10 years ago is not the same as today, uh, except I guess lol is still one of the one we're still using because that's, but, but I'm getting derailed again. I have to play this <laughs> Yeah. I'm glad we were able to get some alone time together. That was honestly one of the best nights of my life. I think it was one of the best nights of my life too. Senior year turned out pretty great, huh? Yeah, it is thanks to you. So, I wish we were headed to the same college. Um, I wish the two everything will be fine. Growers transfer. I'm sure everything will be fine. I'm nervous about it all. I don't know, not really, are you? Yeah, I am. I think I'm most worried about losing touch with close friends from high school. Uh, can make new friends. True friends will stay in touch. I'm sure true friends will stay in touch. At least we can IM or text like whenever. More drawn text! Ah. You know, I'll always be here. 
it's just going to be hard, you know. I bet we can do it. What is what you we do? I don't know. Some couples stay together just for the summer. That's something th that people do, right? Yeah, I think I've heard of people doing that. Actually, wasn't there something like that in the first book game? Now that I think about it. Where Emily had a fling over the summer and then they break up because they go. Uh, her boyfriend went to a different school, uh, college, and then they break up because of that. I think there was something about that. Again, it had been some time since I played it. Even though it doesn't seem like that when maybe this video goes up, but because. I, as I said earlier, I, I, I record a lot of video in one batch to have uh, ready to go out, so it can be two or three weeks between when I record some stuff actually, uh, and then record a ton of stuff. So I have, uh, because I have not the ability, to, uh, ability, the ability uh, as long as I live where I do right now to record every single day or every other day or something like that. And now that it's summer, then I don't even have. I should be lucky if I can actually record anything because of my work and my parents are home all the time almost because of, except for today my father isn't work so I can record anyways what do you think we should do uh, shut up phone maybe that's a possibility uh, pick up after summer what do you want to do I want to stay together fuck it let's stay together we can survive college Awesome source, of course. I don't want to break up. That would be stupid. I'm so happy. I honestly just couldn't see myself with anyone but you. We'll be together forever. <laughs> I should let her meet you, Takeru. Uh, I have lied. Takeru is not. Uh, Kachiro is not my real name. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, Evelyn. I lied to you. I hope she never finds out. I'm glad Evelyn to Evelyn. Actually, now that I think about it, Evelyn, that name sounds. Oh, isn't it um, what is it called in the uh, Stardew Valley? I think there's one called Evelyn that game too. And actually, I've played Stardew Valley a lot when it came out. Um, and actually, there's a punk off kind of girl in the game. Um. That and, and I'm pretty sure her name is Evelyn. I had to check up on that after this uh, because I actually married her in that game. Um, so, but um, I actually also thinking of um, when the co-op part of the game comes out. I actually thinking about playing that, and I'm playing it with Momo when it comes comes out. I hopefully we can do that. So, but yeah. Anyways, like really, you helped me so much this past year, and you've just been so kind and honest with me. I think I love you. <laughs> All right. We are a couple and you think you love me? Mm. And I think I love you too, Evelyn. Can I call you Ev? Oh, what about it? What about Pupkin? Pupkin? Okay, I'm gonna turn off for the night. I'll take you first thing tomorrow, okay? Wow, that was a short episode. If she already. Yeah, let's hang out. Talk to you tomorrow. <laughs> hey, you better! Was that really it, or is Emily coming back? I love this stupid ass. You can now sign out. Okay, so that's... Is that really the end? Is there more? Signed out. Emily's away too. By Carl Steeler. Oh god, what, what? Ah! Okay, it's it just started off on its own. Okay, it's something called the um, LCD sound system. All my friends uh, live on late, but um, I can't listen to that because again, copyrights music. Thanks for playing. So, okay, that's the end apparently. Okay, so it actually had a happy ending. Even though it's kind of broad. I really hope that... Uh, I really hope that they either made uh, make an... Um, 
what's called an update for the game, a, a next chapter. Maybe I really want to see if they can make a, a next chapter for it. Uh, that's after college and how everything went after college. I really want to know that now. Or maybe they make a third game, which continues this story because I'm really interested in this. Also because we still have Emily in the game. Um, and see what that happens after everything. So they could actually continue it, but right now it actually... I don't like it just ends like this, because... Oh, I want to know more, but at least it's a happy ending. <laughs> because I'm together with... This. Apparently, Emma, uh, not Emily, uh, the Evelyn instead. So, and I think she was actually quite cool. I also like that you actually... I think the reason why I didn't get together with Emily, because... I focus more on Evelyn, or not focus on it, but <laughs> the, the time time thing. I actually ended up with um, Evelyn's and uh, making hers every time, and uh, not uh, Emily. So, but I'm really curious. I think maybe this game can have more endings. Like, I think there's an Evelyn ending that I got here. Then there must be an Emily ending that I didn't get because I s didn't get to type everything in. Um, maybe there, I think they said ending also if you don't get any of those two uh, problems solved because you didn't get the time restrictions uh, down. I'm curious also if anyone, well, there must be someone that actually did it by just pressing um, a whole lot of buttons uh, to complete it uh, before the time ran out and not reading the story correctly. So I think maybe four endings this game could have. But um, you can go and explore that for yourself because I have no attention of doing so because it'll be really long and also again I always encourage to, uh, people to buy the games that I play and you can find mostly all of them on Steam um, uh, like this one and some of them of course is not on Steam but you can find them just by searching for them um, in Google instead and you will find them uh, of course you can some of the older games that I play is for consoles and they can be a little harder to get by, but you can still try and see if they are on eBay or stuff like that. Uh, or virtual consoles for that matter, because many of games can actually be bought there now. But anyways, now I'm just rambling, so let's wrap this up. So I hope you enjoyed this episode and this let's play of Emily is Away 2. You can give it a thumb up if you did, you can write a comment down below, you can subscribe for more videos. And I hope you all will have an awesome day, so until next time, farewell.